Good morning everybody, it's me again, Crazy Bag Lady. So it's Sunday morning, uh, quite a nice morning so far I think. I hope you're all well, I'm struggling because I did drink too much Lambrini last night and didn't go to bed till about one o'clock this morning so I'm feeling slightly delicate but I thought we'd do another little skin update on my skin using Avon stuff so let me show you what I've been using. So as you know every morning I've been using this which is Avon True Ageless Triphase Elixir. This is £7 from Avon. I cannot recommend it enough. It is like youth in a bottle. You literally put it on. It's a bit oily when you first put it on, but it soaks into your skin and it's absolutely brilliant. So as you can see, it's got three layers. That's not the bottle. That's the three layers of stuff. And then when you shake it up, it all mixes together. Look, da -da! And then you literally put a few drops on and rub it in. But then also this week, I had this arrive, which is the cream that goes with the elixir, and this is five pound a pot. Literally, it's like what twelve pound to look after your skin. Absolutely amazing. It's even got some protection factor in it. It goes on really creamy, and it dries in, and your skin is just perfect, ready to be put, ready to put your makeup on. And then I use the Avon um primer let me get it hang on right so i use this um and again this just glides on and it like fills in all your wrinkles and makes your skin just so smooth ready to put your foundation on cannot recommend these three products enough even if you don't use avon foundation which i do and it's amazing um but these three products are so worth their weight in gold i think this is normally eight pound but it's quite often quite often on offer for six um it's absolutely brilliant honestly i cannot recommend it enough i used to use a boots one which i think was about 16 pound and this is just the same as the boots one but obviously without the price tag cannot recommend these three enough there's my skin i mean obviously it's a bit red because it's literally been rubbed with cream but that is my skin i'm 41 nearly 42 i have gray hair I don't know if you can see my grey hair, but I have grey hair. Look, the big white one there. Ooh. So, I don't think that's bad at all. My skin wasn't as good as this before. Get yourself some Avon! Oh, and that's my skin with a primer on. Look, it just like fills everything in. You can't get much real and much closer than this. <laughs> the things I do for showing you how good Avon is. This is like the most unflattering angle ever. <laughs> And that is the finished result. So as you can see, it sort of blends your wrinkles in a bit. It's amazing. I don't want to bang, about, bang on about it all day because obviously everyone gets sick of it and some people don't care about the skin. And I never used to. I have to admit, it's kind of Gloria that got me into looking after my skin because Gloria sent me some beautiful samples of like skincare and stuff. And the more I used it, the more I thought, actually, the little bit more you do look after your skin, the better it is. So I always take my makeup off at night now, which sometimes I never used to bother. Um, and I really do believe the more sort of goodness you put into your skin, the better it is. So that's why I do talk about it a little bit now, just to try and encourage anybody else that's rubbish like I was to put a bit of skincare on. For like £12, it's really worth it. <laughs> All right, breakfast this morning. So Ruby's got some cocoa pops and some banana and i've got good old blueberry squares and banana i really need to get back into healthy eating and changing what i eat i tend to when i like something just have it every day and you really shouldn't so after today i'm going to try and eat some different things for breakfast lipstick of the day so lovely amy i hope you're not feeling too poorly today my darling so lipstick of the day uh we've gone over to the darker side of life for a change um so today's lipstick is another Avon one. It's an Avon matte one. I love their matte colours. They're so nice. And this is colour Crave. Yay! So it's like a really dark, ready colour. I actually thought it was a bit more purpley. As you can see, it's really dark. But when I put it on, it was actually like a dark red. So it's actually really nice. Um, it's very like mysterious, nice. And I think maybe in winter it would be really lovely. You know, with like really dark sort of eyeshadow and stuff, it would be really nice. So that's the colour the colour of the lipstick of the day. We're all having a bit of cream. Alright, Sunday morning. So me and Ruby are doing a bit of sewing. Are you ready? No. Why? We've put an embroidery foot on so she can mm. do some freehand embroidery. <laughs> it's fun. <laughs> Oh, 
we're still sewing. So this is me out for the day. I've got skinny black jeans on again. Um, and a very sparkly jumper. Ta-da! I'm very sparkly today. Oh, right, there's little James. He's gone to deliver some more books for the lady across the road because she's reading so many books at the minute and she's so fed up and bored. So we keep sending her books across. So she leaves them on the doorstep and then she sends me the old ones back and then obviously we post the new ones. So good lad, James. I'm scared because I've got nowhere to hold on to anymore. Rubbish, get the other turn the corner. Mm. Right, Ruby's done a card. So we've actually done the card for a lady I know's mum. It's going to be like her 81st birthday, I think, next week. And obviously they're in lockdown, so she said it would be nice for people to send the mum cards that the children have made because her mum used to be a teacher. So this is Ruby's card that she made. Ruby, it's so lovely. Look at Ruby's neat writing. <laughs> I think that's so nice and that lady's going to really, really love it. So we're going to pop it in the post this afternoon. Hopefully it arrives there safely. Mm. Ruby, it's brilliant. Mm. Are you proud of it? Yeah. Yeah, it's amazing. Right, we've got to dinner time. This morning's just flown, but I think it's good to do some crafting. Uh, it stops them being on computers and takes their mind away from other things. So uh, I think it was a successful morning. So uh, for dinner today, I've got a couple of slices of brown bread toasted with lots of butter on, which I really shouldn't be eating, but I will do and I will enjoy it. I'm going to flick through my brochure 8 book, which is the last Avon book they've published. You can't get brochures after this one. So after this, it's all online, which is really sad because I love looking through my Avon book. Um, so I'm going to look through there, see if there's anything I want to treat myself to. And got a cup of coffee in my I Love Shopping mug, which should say, I miss shopping. Well, I've eaten my dinner and I'm still sat here. I've been so lazy. I've been sat looking at stuff on the internet. I haven't even read my Avon book. And I'm, I'm thinking, Jane, you're just wasting your afternoon. Go and do something. But you know when you've been drinking the night before, you feel slightly delicate? Yeah, I've got that feeling. <laughs> I feel so tired. It's horrible. <laughs> anyway, I'm going to move in a minute. Mm, right, I've made it upstairs into my sewing room. Um, I'm trying to think what I can make. I really want to make something. And I want to do something like creative. But I can't think what to do. It's horrible. Um, so I'm sat here thinking. <laughs> oh, right. I don't really know what I'm doing. But I want to do some like freehand embroidery stuff like what Ruby's doing this morning. But I want to do it like handbag related. Because I love handbags so much. And I just, they make me happy. So I'm going to try and make a little handbag thing. I don't really know what I'm doing. It's all trial and error. But let the fun begin. <laughs> Well, it's a work in progress. I don't know what it's a work to, but uh, I'm making a little Chanel handbag. Mm. I still don't really know what I'm doing, but I've made a little handbag. <laughs> so cute. Oh, we now have lipsticks. <laughs> oh, it's 20 past three. Cannot believe it, the day's just gone so fast. So without further ado, let's get the kettle on. We can have a naughty bit of chocolate because it's the weekend. Chocolate don't count on a weekend. <laughs> and I need to get my dinner ready or start it. I'm kissing my kettle. I love it so much. You can, I cannot explain how much happiness this brings. Just like you, Florence. I love this kettle so much. It's so fabulous. Ooh, coffee break naughtiness. So we've got some milk chocolate puddles. They're absolutely beautiful. And I'm going to have one of my posh Marc de Champagne truffles that my mum got me for Christmas. So I only have like one sometimes when I'm being a bit naughty. So oh, we just love the pink box. They come in, isn't it beautiful? Mm, I love shopping mug and a beard mug and a beautiful kettle. Yay! Coffee rain time <clears throat> with my favourite little fur human. <laughs> I love you so much. Do you like looking at the camera? <laughs> Let's have a look at your beautiful face. Where are you? Oh, what have you done to your hair, darling? Are you having a bad hair day? <laughs> That's so cute. And you're starting to go all grey. Look at your little old face. Just like me. We're going grey together, darling. <laughs> Oh, is that nice? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, Mummy, that's so cute. I love you, Mummy. <laughs> mm, do you like having a good old scrub? 
I could hold stroke, is it nice, eh? Hmm. You wouldn't think something so cute could be go from being so adorable like this to so evil. <laughs> You're very special, aren't you, my darling? Hey. That's it, you lay back. Oh yes, we'll appreciate the loveliness of Miss Florence. <laughs> Look, they're like a little seal when you move their ears. Are you a little seal? <laughs> hey. Oh, look at me ironing. I've got some iron in there, iron in there. And ironing all behind me. And my ironing board's ready. And the dinner needs doing and we're just sat here having cuddles. Oh, I love my little Florence so much. Right, anyway, we need to do like multitasking. So I need to do my ironing, ring my mum and get my dinner doing. Woo! Let's see if we can do three things at once. Only happy when he's out there with cars. I wish he paid that much attention to me. Maybe I need an engine. <laughs> it's our wedding anniversary next Saturday. We've been married 12 years. I think I need to become more truck-like. <laughs> my mum didn't answer. So I think she must be busy. She's perhaps in her garden like we were yesterday. So I guess we'll try again in a bit. Now I feel grumpy because I can't get hold of my mum. Ooh, I need done. I got a hold of my mum, so I've had a lovely chat with my mum. And then we were just discussing, because I'm cooking pork, um, I was just saying that my crackling doesn't go very crispy sometimes. So um, she was saying, have you read your instruction book for your oven? Look how thick it is. Um, to try it on a different setting to see if it might make the pork more crispy. So I flicked it onto an old-fashioned static setting rather than a fan-assisted setting. So we'll see what my pork looks like. Ooh. Does it smell like it's burning? I can't make my mind up. <laughs> oh, I was a bit hot in the kitchen, so I've come in the room everywhere I go. Miss Winifred's never far behind. It's so funny. I literally looked down and thought, really? You followed me? You followed me in the room from the kitchen? So I'm going to go back in the kitchen. I'm just going to see if she follows me. <laughs> Stand at the oven and she's gonna stop me. Ooh, so there's my roasters, they're like little new potato roastings that I make. I didn't want to leave them in much longer because I didn't want to burn them, so I've, my meat's got 10 minutes left. So I've took these out, they look lovely, don't they? Wow! So I'm just checking out my meat through my oven door, and so's my friend. <laughs> so funny because I just like bent down looking through the glass and then as I'm looking at the glass she keeps looking as well it's so funny what do you think do you think the meat's cooking all right I'm not sure are you I think it might be doing all right because it's bubbling <laughs> you're actually sat on my foot <laughs> no I don't need to wash thank you cafe's open so the cafe is open mid ears so we've got roast uh, pork, little roast tasty things and lots of veg. So off to enjoy it. Ooh, dinner was delicious. But now I've got to wash up. Oh, well, load the dishwasher up, but it's horrible. It's all greasy pans. All oh, right, James has got the Ben and Jerry's ice cream again. It's an absolute pain in the neck. I've just put it in the microwave to try and soften it up a bit a lot. I can't cope with ice cream that you can't get out. Ugh, it's so stressful. Right, back in the microwave. It's pudding time. My lipstick's still on. It's not completely on, but this is what's lasted all day. So I think it's done really well. Hmm, it's all right. You just rest your little fat chin on my leg. <laughs> Oh, right, it's half past seven at night and I realised I need to go out here because I need to water my tree that we planted yesterday because if we don't water it, it might die. So I'm just going to nip outside and give it a quick water. Oh, mm -hmm. 
You didn't follow me outside, did you? No, it was too cold, wasn't it? <laughs> oh, made me and hubby a drink. So I've got a cup of tea and my mug from Roseanne. Roseanne, this mug's so beautiful. I feel so loved. Thank you. Oh, just having a look at me, Avon book. So I have to share this with you because Ruby's got one of these and it's absolutely amazing. It's so worth the £6. It lights your room up. It makes a beautiful shadow from the little elephant it's so stunning in fact let me show you hang on right i'm in ruby's room in the dark are you ready Ta -da! look how adorable is that for six pound we all need one it's so lovely and it makes like lights on the walls can you see that ruby loves it so much honestly i cannot recommend it enough it's so cute beautiful sunset I forgot I've left Florence outside. Everywhere looks pink. It's really fascinating. Florence. I'll come and get you in a minute, my darling. I forgot I've left you out there. <laughs> Oh, look at that sky. That's absolutely beautiful. Oh, all my lights are lit up again. You can spot all my little cherry goodies, can't you? Oh, it's so cute. <laughs> Oh, right. Super fast Avon favourites. I thought I'd quickly show you this before we run out of time tonight because it's getting late. They've got a fab five-in-one beauty kit where you can get all those products for £15. Absolutely amazing. Right, what else did I like? Oh, the good old lip oil, which is still on offer for £4. I've struggled to get this, but I presume they must have some more stock in. So, don't worry if you do order it. I'm sure you'll still get it because I know Lucy, she managed to get some the other day. Um, my other favourite was... Where's it gone? Let me find out. Some of the pyjamas. Some of the pyjamas are on offer. Um, so I think that's really good for like £10 for some pyjamas. I thought I might get me and Ruby some. They look really, really nice. And also on offer, um, this is the eye cream that I've been using. I use this every morning and at night. And it's on offer now for £10, which is absolutely really good. It really works. And then this is also the night cream that I've been using as well. And it's also on offer for 12 It's normally 15 You only need a tiny bit and it really does lift your skin. So good. Um, and then there's the other Elixir stuff. Where is it? There's somewhere here. So this is what I was talking about this morning. That's the elixir. And then I've been using the day cream. Obviously, they do an overnight gel, which I've not tried. But the day cream is really good. Obviously, I'm using the other night cream that's £12 at the minute. But when I get through that, I might treat myself to some of this. They also do some radiance cream as well. Which I'm wondering if probably that would be really nice as well. Lightweight facial oil and radiance day cream. I'd like to try that, but that's lovely. Ooh more goodies for your feet so if you order something from that side of the foot care you can then get these silicon socks lock which um helps you with your dry cracked heels so i do get cracked heels so i think i'm going to try some of this and see what it's like oh nearly done so i also want to try this they've got it on offer you buy all three for seven pound but i've heard this is really good this is for like hair loss um, and some ladies on a group of men have tried this and they swear by it. They reckon it's absolutely brilliant. So, because uh, my hair is quite thin, I really want to try that. But they also do a volumizing one as well, which I would imagine that's really good as well. So they're on offer lot, £7 each. So you get the shampoo, conditioner and the treatments that go with it. So for £7, I think it's really good. And not last but not least is the pack that I talked about last night where you get all that for £8. Uh, not £8, sorry, £10, which is absolutely brilliant. So you get eight items, £10. Uh, that's £4 on its own. They're £2 on their own. So as you can see, you get a lot of money's worth of stuff for £10. Um, but this is meant to be amazing. The Aromatherapy Beauty Sleep uh, Pillow Mist. So you spray it on your pillow 
and everybody said, everyone that's tried it, they said it gives them really good night's sleep. It's absolutely brilliant. So I'm thinking about getting some of that to um, use for Ruby because she suffers with sort of sleep sometimes. So, but I thought, well, rather than paying £4 for that, you might as well buy the whole lot for 10 because I will use the rest of the stuff. So that's my little Avon bargains. Ooh, I nearly forgot. The Faraway Rebel that smells like alien is on offer for £8. I didn't want anybody to miss out on that because it's absolutely brilliant. It will normally be... Uh, 11 so you get three pound off it if you order it at the minute ah so that's all my little avon favorites i hope you've enjoyed it um sadly that is the last a1 book that they have printed at the minute so this is brochure eight and this is the last one so from now on it has to be online so even i don't want to do it online because i love having a book to flick through i like to sniff the pages on the perfume samples and stuff and but we can't do it till all this virus is over it's really really sad so <clears throat> anyway, I've enjoyed this book. Mm. <laughs> so from now on, it'll all be online. Anyway, my dears, so many thanks for joining me today. I hope you've enjoyed it. Obviously, we've done a lot of sewing, ironing, cooking, testing out different settings on my oven, which made my pork taste absolutely beautiful. I've had a sparkly jumper on all day, which is now reflecting under my chin. <laughs> so I hope you're all all right. Sending love to you all. I know we're still going through a very odd time, and obviously it's going to roll over to Monday again, and it's like Groundhog Day and it's just so so strange but we've just got to hang in there so we're all in it together that's why I video every single day for all of you um I know some days people perhaps get a bit bored of me but I sort of think I'm here for all of you so until this is over we will continue to video every single day and go live on Wednesday nights eight o'clock so please if you do enjoy life in England and staying in then please subscribe to my channel come and find me on Instagram as Mrs Crazy Bag Lady on TikTok as Jane Walker with two R's and also my little Avon shop if you did want to treat yourself to anything of course I understand if you don't like Avon or anything I won't be offended but if you did want to treat yourself then the link to my shop is in the little comment section down below if you spend 20 pounds you get free UK delivery direct to your door so if you're going to spend 16 and spend £3.50 on postage, you might as well spend 20 and get free postage. Um, if you only want one lipstick, then fair enough, pay the postage. But if not, treat yourself that little bit extra and get the free, free delivery to your door. It's so cheerful. It cheers you up so much. You literally, you just stay at home and then a lovely parcel appears with all goodies in. It's so nice. So anyway, my dears, I love you and leave you and I'll speak to you tomorrow. Take care. Bye.